Welcome to the Crazy Down Podcast. I'm Jonas. And I'm TNT Don. I'm Mike the Explosive One, and we have a very special guest. I don't care. He's still special. I appreciate that. Mr. X coming yeah, at you. Absolutely. Crazy Town Media World Headquarters. Exactly. So, guys. Yo. Something I've always wanted to do is actually going to happen. A Coming out of the closet. <laughs> Finally, thank God. Jonas. I was really wondering when this was going to happen. happen to me. Uh, <laughs> Live your truth. An Australian guy named Aron D'Souza okay, no. wants to host a new style and event. Mm. It is an Olympic style competition for drug taking athletes. For drug taking athletes. Oh, yeah. okay. It's, it's like called the enhancing. Enhanced Games. And I'm like, they should have sports leagues that let awesome. the people do anything they want. No drug testing allowed. This is the stupidest thing I've ever heard. It is not. It is the dumbest thing I've ever heard. It doesn't matter if it's roids or HGH or meth. Do whatever you want. No drug testing. Baseball. On no what, drug testing. On what planet Football. do you think this is a good idea? All? This is a terrible idea. What? It's Mr. an Act, awful what? idea. I, I, I think it would be... I, I like the idea of having an event. Think like logically. That. Think like, logically. No, no. I, like, I think it'd be interesting to watch for a little while, no. but it's not something that I think would I'd want to replace the NFL. Right? No, no. It'd be, it'd be supplemental. I know, but it's just like, I wouldn't keep watching it. I'd be like, oh, okay, that's interesting. All I, right, I'm good. I find it hard to believe that these two guys who last week spoke about the housing crisis and all of these numbers and legalities. And, <laughs> I didn't, I didn't and say I was going to play TNT. I just to watch it. And, 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 and integers. And, and you can't see the forest from the trees where as soon as somebody dies because they were taking too many performance-enhancing drugs to perform in this league, it's a lawsuit. Even no, if you have, waiver, they're bro. not making them do it. Bruh, it's their choice. Bruh. Like, they waive. You don't. You can spill hot coffee on yourself and sue. Yeah, what are you they didn't sign a waiver before they got free. it. The league. I wanted to perform well in the league, and I feel like the league perpetuated that I, I didn't perform. I was going to be off the team. Yeah, but if there's a contract that says, okay, bruh. yeah, uh huh, name any contract that's going to be like, oh, this man died. Yeah. You might die. Okay, I'm then. okay with that. So, like sign I said, up. legal fiasco. I want to be the first one to sue him. I want to sign up for the first lawsuit because it's guaranteed to win. Well, you you'll be dead. Is that really? <laughs> is that really? Well, you really want to be that guy because it's really your, your heirs that will be doing the suing. Look, even if I get hurt, and and then even if he has an airtight contract, imagine that. How how ethical is this contract? Where you're like. It does not matter if you take too many drugs and die. We absolve ourselves of all guilt. Get the fuck out of here, you asshole. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you want to see someone throw a shot put like a hundred yards? I, I do. I, but hyped up on meth and human growth hormones. Just like just fucking shoot it. that thing in the next stadium. <laughs> listen, listen, I do. I do. I want to see comic book characters, all right? I want to see yeah, real life yeah. Marvel. I do. Yeah. Right. But they don't exist, all right? They we will. gotta live in what we are. We are human beings I, and until the aliens come down and start creating milk mutants when they mate with us. We gotta live what we I, got. I, I, I see your point, TNT. I really see I it. I see it. And, and I get it. I get it. I think you're I think on some levels that you're right. Um I I <laughs> I, 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 tell me why I'm wrong. Well, no, I also no. think that it, that that your your view of it is is a really sad. Uh, wow. No, 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 not not a, a sad commentary on where we are as a society that oh. that we don't live in an area where you're allowed to, you know, you can do what you want to yourself. You yeah, know? man. And it's that, 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 well, that it become well, not even that, that you can do. Like, I don't think you know. I get it. You can do what you want to not do what you want, but it's like. That that someone else is liable for something you do to yourself like that like I'm like that kind of sucks. The problem is not where the autonomy of being able to do something for yourself. The problem lies in when you incentivize doing harm to yourself. Yep. But yep. how is there an incentive? You're paying these people, right? A reasonable wage. If they're they, not making if, if MLB they, money. If they, per, if they don't perform up to the standards of, I don't know, say somebody else on performance enhancing drugs, they're not going to be on the team, right? Or they're going to ride the bench, right? Which means they make less money, right? 
Or they make no money because but, go home and take your roided out ass and go sit the fuck down. Into the so, D League of steroid leagues. You have multiple levels. So, so what becomes your <laughs> what becomes your only option? I gotta do more steroids. What if you, I gotta be but, the better but guy? But there's diminishing returns with steroids. Like there there, are. you peak and like you can take as many as you want and you're your peak at some point, right? 100%. And then you'll kill yourself at at some point. But somewhere around if there you're not good enough to make it on rider. steroids how that makes you feel imagine what if you're not good enough to make it on the team and you're doing roids how would you feel well about that? That, that, that well is let's, let's think about what's really happening if it's really a lucrative thing it's still going to be the best athletes right that that, that 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 also participate right because yeah, yeah. if if you put me out there in the field with some professional athlete and roid us both up he's still going to whip my ass because mm -hmm. he's he's already has that in, in like inherent talent so like it's it's really more i think the interesting side of it is is more what can these people do at the p it's um it, it's a little circusy like in like i want to see basketball players dunk from the three-point line okay Bro, i mean look <laughs> I, that's what i want to see i i agree that i want to see that and, and for the spectacle of it all yeah, i that, still that's... don't feel like it's worth a person killing themselves over it but i agree choice. i agree I'm, I'm i'm with you on there I, it's, it, it's choice yeah what the nfl people take it's roids because choice. they want to get better it's not choice it's the, not choice. Same thing happens in the NFL. Tell uh, me it doesn't. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give you a knife, and I'm going to say stab yourself in the leg right now. Why would I do that? Exactly. Now I'm going to say I'm going to give you a knife, and if I give you, I don't know, $500,000, stab yourself in the leg. <laughs> oh, all of a sudden it seems like, all right, huh? No, it's your choice. The fuck out of It is your choice. It's not. No. I'm an asshole. I'm incentivizing people. I'm flexing money in your face and incentivizing people to hurt themselves. But it happens for money. anyway. It's cr it, it happens does, anyway. It does happen anyway, but it happens not at the detriment of like filling yourself with. You're chemicals. telling some rich you doesn't go up to a homeless guy and tell him to give him a hundred bucks to lick his boots. I mean, that doesn't make it right. <laughs> I will say I'm not saying that this is have, right. I'm saying that somebody seen that should happen? be able to do what they want. You would have had a better argument if you had said if you've seen NFL players who are like, oh, my finger's broken. Rip that some bitch off so I can keep playing. That's crazy. That's crazy. And that's and that's borderline. It's a true story. And exactly. Happened. And that's borderline where we're at right now, where we're at with this story, except I feel like this is even worse because it's more like, hey, we don't care what drugs you do, which is like when you take a lax view on something, you're basically saying we allow it. All their if I were to take a lax view on prostitution, guess what? I'm allowing prostitution. All they say <laughs> is we don't drug test. Yeah, okay, so we don't... We Companies don't, don't drug test. So are you trying to say they're incentivizing you to do meth? So, uh, yeah. Is there, yes. Yes. Wow. They're basically saying we take meth and crackheads here. And that's what you're going to get applying for the job. Somebody who doesn't, you know interesting but those aren't going to be high, those are probably not going to be high performing employees for very long they're not going to be there very long like oh, this thing right. they're like any of those drugs you take there's going to be a limit to the performance enhancing capabilities right so <laughs> if this league were lucrative enough to make that it's like this dude's probably some broke dude in a trailer in in alabama like he it's <laughs> I mean, it's the same wrong. guy handing out nitrogen like okay. It's, yeah, it's okay okay you know it's like okay. it's not there's not gonna be enough money and what 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 uh, Jonas is talking about that's that gets to the level. I get where you're taking it. I understand, and I think it's you know it's like all the dudes at the gym that are clearly roided up, right? Like, what's their incentive to do it? Women, Van vanity, vanity. It, it, well, yeah, it's probably some level of narcissism, I would assume, but mental disorder. Yeah, it's exactly. also it's also there's a just as there's like body Autism. dysmorphia, there's muscle dysmorphia where yeah. people like they don't think that they're buff even though their muscles are bigger than most people like their biceps are bigger than most people's thighs like they don't think that they're big and strong and fit and ripped and it's like the opposite of like the regular body dysmorphia it's called i can't remember what it's called but there's like a documentary about it like how bodybuilders you see those bodybuilders and they inject all that crap in their biceps and disgusting. they get all disgusting yeah. disgusting so like those people you see don't those look guys normal. flexing it's just like ooh, like it bursts open it's like oozing stuff it's just like yeah, I don't no. need that in my life. No, nope. I got enough problems. Yeah. Nah. Either way, I think, like I said, though, with this whole thing, I think it is. It sounds great on paper, but when you see the people that it affects, you're gonna be like, "Yo, that's it's pretty. It's like cattle." It's. it's I mean, it's. Insane. it's insane. I look. I want to see. I want to see Superman jump across the building too. I want to see it <laughs> IRL. It's not gonna happen. Stick to the CG, man. Stop. Don't incentivize people to hurt themselves. It's insanity. It's insanity. <laughs> It is. It just is. But it's happening in Australia, so, you know, fine. We'll let hey, them do whatever they want. They're down under, dude.
<laughs> exactly. They're on a little island. I don't. I don't know they're what they do over there. The water spins the opposite direction in the toilet. Makes people crazy. Is that true? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I guess so. I don't know if it is or not, yeah. but it makes them crazy. Anyways, that's all the time we have today. So go to the Crazy Town Con for Jonas, TNT, and Mr. X. We out. We are out.